The Follinger family documentary is in the works, and you could possibly be part of it by sharing any stories you may have had with founder Lean Follinger. Joining us to give us more details on the open video call interviews is president and CEO of the foundation, Ed Komanowski. Good morning, Ed. Good Thanks morning. so much for Good being morning. here. Yeah, thank you. All right, so tell us about the family documentary and what it will highlight. Yeah, this is a great opportunity. I think people see the Follinger name, uh, so whether it's the Botanical Gardens or something mm -hmm. like that, uh, people don't know the history. So. Uh, Oscar, their, her grandfather came in the 1800s, so there's a long lineage here. And so uh, Helene was actually 25 years old when she took the paper over uh, when her father passed away suddenly. So this is an opportunity for us to kind of peel back some of the layers and find out who the family is and share that back out with the community. We're excited about it. Tell us more about Helene herself. Helene was an amazing woman. Uh, so she took over the newspaper and the News Sentinel when she was 25 years old. She just graduated from the University of Illinois. Uh, so that was in the 1930s. So you can imagine mm -hmm. uh, here's this really strong, powerful woman uh, dynamic in the 30s. Uh, certainly was a man's world at the time. Mm -hmm. uh, and, you know, she was really a silent leader in the community. And so when she passed away, unfortunately, uh, she left the proceeds to the foundation. Uh, so she and her mother were really kind of guiding behind the scenes. And so, uh, you know, we think of uh, Helene as this really kind of um, a, a good businesswoman, mm -hmm. uh, I think, you know, the great stories about that, but she also had a really fun side. Uh, she loved to be outside, loved horses. Her horse's name was Shenanigans, Aww, you know, so, <laughs> uh, so it's, it's fun just to be able to see not just the business side, uh, but also see the casual side of it. So we're, we're excited to be able to show that to the community. Tell us about the open call video interviews uh, or the open call interviews and mm -hmm. when is it and what's the goal of this? Any instructions people need to know? Yeah, absolutely. So it'll be Friday, February 25th uh, from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Uh, at the Botanical Conservatory. Uh, there are 20 minute spots. And so if they go to fullinger.org uh, backslash documentary, they'll be able to sign up. But you do have to sign up uh, because obviously mm -hmm. there's going to be an open call for that. You may or not, may or not be uh, featured in the, the documentary itself, but um, part of it is the film, part of it is capture history, you know, mm -hmm. so it's something that we'll be able to use at the foundation. Uh, we have great stories of, in snowstorms, Helene would come in uh, bringing sandwiches and beer, uh, so that way they could get the paper out, and so I think there's a lot of people, if you knew her, you know, mm -hmm. please take the time and come and, and sign up for a 20-minute slot and tell your story. Yeah, that's very cool. What artifacts from the family home will be featured in the documentary? Quite a bit. Uh, what's neat about the family is they really documented. Uh, so if you've uh, never been in the foundation, there's actually the library, which has a lot of their personal effects, uh, table, mm -hmm. clock. Uh, and then we're going to actually have more of her photos. Uh, they cataloged, and so there's a lot of family films. Uh, we're getting those done. Um, so it'll be nice to be able to share that back out uh, because sometimes we see, just like on the, the lead-in, you know, you see a picture mm -hmm. of, of Helene and Esther and the family, uh, but we'll be able to share more of those individual pieces. Um, a lot of personal documents as uh, she corresponded with uh, presidents and, and things mm -hmm. like that. So uh, again, a, as a woman leader at the time, she was at the top and it was amazing uh, to see who she rubbed elbows with and uh, how she led Fort Wayne kind of quietly from behind. For sure. Thank you so much for being here with us this morning. As you said, open call interviews are on February 25th from 10 to 5 p.m. You will need to sign up in advance. You can find the link to register on Wayne.com.